Good Monday morning. It is frigid out there as you head out the door, so make sure that you are well bundled up. Grab the scarves, the jackets, the heavy jackets, as well as the gloves. Now you also want to give yourself a little bit of extra time this morning to scrape off the windshield. There is some frost out there. We are actually under a freeze warning until 8 o'clock this morning because we are seeing temperatures below the freezing mark. And we're also dealing with some wind chills on top of some already very cold temperatures. So we'll get right to them. It is currently 32 degrees here in Lexington, so we are right at that freezing mark. But it is 30 degrees in Richmond, 29 for Stanton, Jackson, as well as London, 28 in Somerset, 25 in Monticello. And again, those are your actual air temperatures. And we are starting out well below the average low where we should be for this time of year. That is 43 degrees. Now the average high is 63 degrees. Unfortunately, we're not going to be making it to that average high for today. We'll only be seeing temperatures topping out in the mid 50s. So it's going to be cool throughout the day. But this morning, boy, is it cold out there. And again, we're seeing actual air temperatures in the low 30s and some upper 20s out there already. But with just enough of a breeze in some locations, Unfortunately, we're dealing with a wind chill in most locations as well. In fact, it feels like 15 degrees in Monticello. The feels like temperature here in Lexington is 24. Same for Richmond, 29 in Stanton as well as Jackson. So some locations are affected more so than others just because of a little bit more of a breeze out there. But aside from the colder temperatures, really nothing's going on. That's the main story this morning is just the cold. But we are looking at some quiet conditions out there. We've been seeing some breaks in the clouds, so some locations will see a little bit of sunshine to start off. But you can also see some clouds building back in. So we'll see some broken clouds as we head through your Monday. Unfortunately, any sunshine we would see is not going to be helping to warm up temperatures too much. We'll be just settling into the 50s for today. Now, we do have a cold front off to our west. It's not going to be giving us a good chance for rain showers. In fact, I think most of the activity will be staying to our north. What it will do for us is help to reinforce colder temperatures into your Tuesday. So we'll expect another day with temperatures only topping out in the 50s. In fact, I think we will be cooler tomorrow compared to what we will be seeing this afternoon. But again, this morning, again, a very cold start. Make sure that you are bundled up wearing the extra layers, but also grab a pair of sunglasses. Some of the viewing area will be seeing some sunshine before the clouds begin to really work back in. And we'll see maybe some peaks of sunshine as we head through the day, but it really looks like we'll hold on to a little bit of extra cloud cover because of that cold front moving through. Rain showers, as you can see, look to stay to our north. So we're really not looking at a great chance for any activity for today. We should mainly stay on the dry side. A few showers could move into some of our northern counties, but I think a good portion of that should stay out of the viewing area. Now it's going to be another cold start for your Tuesday, but at least we'll stay on the dry side. And we'll work in a little bit more sunshine as we head through your Tuesday as well. But again, that cold front is going to help to reinforce those colder temperatures. So we'll probably only see highs on Tuesday right around 50 degrees. And I wouldn't be surprised if some locations only top out in the upper 40s. Now, as we head into your Wednesday, we'll see a little bit of extra cloud cover. Temperatures will still be cooler overall for your Wednesday. We'll generally see them in the lower 50s. And we will start to see a little bit of a later chance for some rain showers. So it looks like through a good portion of Wednesday, we should stay dry. But eventually, we will start to add some rain showers to the mix as well. But with the rain showers, we'll also come a warm up. But for today, we'll stay dry. Temperatures only topping out at 55 degrees. We'll see broken clouds, a stray shower possible to the north, but mainly we should stay dry and a little bit on the breezy side as well. So I'll wear the jacket throughout the day. Tonight, temperatures will be back into the 30s with mostly cloudy skies. We should be staying dry as well. But by later Wednesday, we will start to see a little bit more activity. Temperatures still staying in the 50s, but by Thursday and Friday, temperatures will finally be back into the 60s. But we will start to see that chance for some rain showers as an area of low pressure as well as a cold front will start to move through and they'll be lingering giving us that chance as we head through the weekend but at least temperatures will be making their way back into the 60s.